In this video, I'm going to explain how an ex-NBA player and his OnlyFans wife fooled us all for one week. After going viral, this basketball wife with three names has been doing interview after interview after interview after interview after interview. When you read between the lines and scratch beneath the surface, it all comes clear why they both decided to make the initial viral video. Okay, let's play like this. Jasmine left New York in 2006 to go to Germany okay. because she was tired of popping that Gucci. And so she said, we're going to become Kiss Major. Okay. Um, I felt homesick. And I was like, all this basketball wife shit going on over there. I'm about to go home and find me a book. The case, and did she ever express to you wanting to do reality television? Uh, yeah, she expressed reality TV, but... Do you see the play developing? Not to, not to pocket watch. But since this last couple of days, what did the OnlyFans numbers look like? Um, I was in the top 22% yeah. before. Yeah. I'm in the top 0.47 right now. <laughs> Bomb drop! Ching the ching, ladies and yeah, gentlemen. Daddy, thank you so much. I'm so happy to you know, give you what you want. Hey. I, 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 so, like, what does that look like money wise? Cha ching. <laughs> <laughs> but it's not just the OnlyFans. I'm getting more, <clears throat> more money and there's more opportunity. Like, Cocktail Hour with Kiss has like mad people wanting to book parties now. Um, the moving company, people have been calling, like, oh, we're having a move on this day. Can we, you know, and. Um, that was the whole purpose of doing it, correct? Um, actually, no, I didn't have any, it wasn't, I didn't come in this with, um, with a agenda. Why the f*** you lying? Why you always lying? Clearly, she had a game plan from the start, but was Joe Smith in on it? Now, I'm extremely perceptive, and I know I can see things that other people can't see. But before we get into the hard evidence that's on her OnlyFans page that shows that Joe Smith was probably in on this, I notice small details like this. I find it an extremely odd coincidence that he was wearing a Golden State Warriors shirt and Golden State Warriors team shorts that the Warriors play in in that initial pre-recorded viral video. He practically dressed in the uniform of the team that drafted him number one. That was done for the same reason that athletes wear their jerseys in the commercials when they don't have as much facial recognition to the casual fan but i digress listen to this video by someone who actually bought the only fan subscription but one video i found on there that lets me know that in fact this thing is a scam walk with me so one of the videos that she posted recently is with another man it does not show the person's picture or his face or nothing like that you know what i'm saying right now bro the pause is happening right now pause all of that and it will lead you to speculate that this is actually Joe Smith in the video. So they are in on this whole thing. And he's not the only one on the internet that have noticed that. When is you having time to got to play with your pussy? You feel me? Like, what is, when is you doing this? When he's not home. When the hell he not <laughs> home? That's retired. <laughs> right. Like, how you don't hear the vibrator in the other room? And moreover, she admitted that they recorded a scene together. So I have a video of us, but I haven't really like been putting it out there. Yeah, I don't think you could put that up. Yeah, I don't think you should do that without his permission. I mean, I Watch her response when she finds out how much Adam Twenty Two and his wife made off of that one scene with that one guy. Adam Twenty Two, have you ever heard of him? Oh, I heard of him. Yeah. Actually, my people are reaching out to see if he wants to talk to me. Yeah, yeah. recently Adam had his wife shoot with another man it literally broke the internet and you know adam is not saying how much he made but you know us pop watching people that you know in yeah. podcast land it's definitely well over eight figures what? for sure come on joe come home let's do it again come on daddy <laughs> it's just figure it out new, new profession bring it home <laughs> The single most biggest piece of evidence that Joe Smith is in on it is this right here. 
They are both being interviewed separately and soon to be jointly by Kevin Wesley, who did the Cheesecake Factory date interview, who many believe orchestrated the entire skit because it first appeared on his channel and he got the first and only exclusive interview with both of them. And I have a pop-up that you can click on at the end of this video where I prove that that was a skit because one of the outtakes leaked out. Even when TMZ dropped the original video of the Joe Smith wife OnlyFans gate, it had Kevin Wesley's name and act in the video. This man is the skit master. I respect the grind, but we high IQ over here. We got to shoot it straight. In these interviews, she keeps saying that Joe won't answer the phone when I call. Our relationship is on the rocks. Y'all clearly got the same manager booking the same interviews where it looked like y'all are riding in the same car to promote yourself for the... Cha -cha. <laughs> Click right here to see me prove that the Cheesecake Factory date video was a skit.